As anyone who's experienced an ant infestation will tell you, these tiny terrors sometimes seem to be inexorably drawn to all things electronic. Be it a light switch or a plug socket, they'll end up swarming in it and eventually cause it to short circuit and break. But why? What is it about the electrical items that make them so attractive to ants? This is the question which a group of researchers from Texas addressed in the early 90s. To do this, they examined the response of several ants, including the infamous red imported fire ant, Solidopsis invicta, to various stimuli associated with electrical equipment, such as the presence of magnetic fields, electromagnetic fields, and even whether the wire insulation used had an effect. They concluded that the ants were in fact attracted to the electric fields produced by the items. This isn't the end of the story, however, as nature can sometimes be more complicated than we first realise, and further studies revealed that fire ants only gathered in areas of circuitry where there was no insulation. This was because what was actually happening was one ant would come into contact with a bare wire and get electrocuted. This caused them to start a behaviour called gastroflagging, where they wave their abdomens and release pheromones, including an alarm pheromone. Upon smelling this, other ants in the vicinity were drawn to the wire and electrocute themselves, which caused more ants to be attracted, and so on and so on. So if you want to stop your electronics being fried by ants, stop the ants being fried by electronics. So yeah, thank you for watching. If you want to learn more about ants, again, visit antweb.org, where I got these images, and please like, share, comment, and subscribe. See you later.